a long ass time ago, there was a whole bunch of, of these people called Jedi, which are basically magic space wizards, but like only certain people can be them. And if you got enough like fucking Jubal Giles in your blood, you're a really good space wizard guy. They're space wizards and they're called the Jedi, the, the Jedi. And people were like, hey, why are the Jedi so cool? So they made this order called Order 66, um, which they were like, hey, we're going to kill all the space wizards, which was like pretty fair because like the space wizards are like hey only we get these secret swords and these secret knowledges fuck everybody else it's because our blood is better um we've got we've got way more red blood cells than you guys uh so we get we get fucking uh cool shit and the people that are like yeah let's send a bunch of clones to kill the jedis so the clones come in and the clones were really cool and the clones like kicked the shit out of the jedi because they were really strong and shit and then only like a couple Jedi's were left. So there's there's a couple Jedi's. There's this Jedi. Uh, his name is Obi Wan, and then there's Obi Wan's master, Kai Gon. Uh, and then and then they're on an adventure. They're like, we're the last Jedi, Avatar, the last Airbender Jedi. And then they meet this guy. Um, they meet this guy named Jar Jar Binks, and he's like, "You're so so cool. Let's be best friends." And then, um, so he then joins these last two Jedi's, and then and then these guys, uh, they find a small dirty child in the sewers or some shit, and he's like, "I'm real good at f I'm real good at fucking being fast." Um, and they're like, "Well, let's adopt this child." So they adopt this child from his mom, who's like, "Yeah, take him. I don't give a shit. I'm a fucking slave. It's all right. You can have my weird child." And uh, the child was really fast, and he won a pod race. And so they took this child, and they took this child to this princess, and she was all like, "Holy shit, I love this child. I can I have this child?" And they're like, "No." Uh, and she's like, "That sucks." And they're like, "He's got super. He's got that special wizard blood." We got to take him to our wizard people. So they take him to the wizard people people and they're like, this guy's going to fuck up everything. We shouldn't, we shouldn't, we shouldn't make him a Jedi, but they do make him a Jedi anyway. Anyway, this guy gets stabbed by some four armed guy. There's some guy and he's like, Hey, yo, what's up? I've got several lightsabers. Pew, 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 pew. And he's a robot and he's got kind of like a face like this. And he's like, I'm a robot guy. And he's got four lightsabers and he fucks up this guy. Um, anyway, this small child then grows up. Here, I gotta... Next movie. Next movie, sorry. This guy is now grown up. This little child is now grown up in a space wizard. Uh, as shown by his hat. Uh, <laughs> anyway, next movie. Movie two. Uh, the guy is grown up and the princess is there. And she's like, I think you're cute! And he's like, I don't like sand. Uh, and then she gets kidnapped and put on this uh, other place and she has to like backflip her way out and he's like oh wait never mind I like you now um, and so they're like and the other guy's like hey I'm now your master uh, you can't you can't have babies uh, because you're a, you're a space wizard and space wizards aren't allowed to have babies for some reason I don't know um, and, and he's like oh man but I like her way more than I like sand um and then, uh, and then the Order sixty six happens, and they're like, "Oh no, um, we gotta, we gotta protect people." And he's like, "Okay, but let me bang this chick first. So they bang in secret. Um, meanwhile, he's like doing fighting and stuff. I don't actually know this movie that well, but I think he's doing stuff during it. Anyway, next movie. This girl's all like. Space wizard, I'm pregnant! And he's like, oh my god, I'm gonna be a daddy. But then this other little guy comes up, this shitty little guy, and he's like, hey, you should kill everybody. And he's like, why? And he's like, because I told you to do it. Um, so the little shitty guy convinces the space wizard that he should kill everybody. So he goes to his Jedi temple, and, um... And he finds a bunch of babies, and he's like, whoa, there's a shit ton of babies. Don't mind that I'm... Oh, also, he wears a lot of eyeliner now. I should mention that. He's now evil space wizard, so he wears a lot of eyeliner. Um, and, and there's a, a whole bunch of space babies that got that weird blood. And he's like, wow, babies, I'm going to have one of those soon. Um, I'm going to kill them. So he kills them. And then meanwhile, she gets real sick, and she, and she almost dies because she's got the babies. Um, but they're able to save the babies. And guess what? There's actually two babies. The two babies. 
Um, and then this guy, um, he goes and his master shows up and he's like, it's over, Anakin. I got the high ground. He's up taller. Uh, and he's got way longer legs and he's up tall and like, he's all like, Hey, fuck you. And he pulls out his lightsaber and he tries to fight him, but then he falls into lava and loses like 80% of his body. But then this little shitty guy over here comes in. He's like, don't worry, I'll rebuild you. And he like rebuilds him into this mecha guy with a penis helmet. And he's all like, ah, and they're like, it seems, my lord, in your anger, you killed your wife who was going to have the babies. And he's like, no, but he didn't actually kill the babies. The babies were actually fine. They were born. And then some other guy I don't know was all like, oh, we've always wanted a daughter. We'll take this one. And then they're like, what about the other one? And they're like, well, I don't fucking know. I guess we'll just give him to his family because apparently he has family. Because it's apparently if you're trying to keep somebody away from somebody, it's just the best if you put them with your family. Anyway, next movie. Movie four, A New Hope. Um... That this little boy that got put with the family, he grows up and he's like, oh, man, living on a living on a fucking dirt planet sucks ass. Good thing my dad I don't know exists will never look for me here on dirt planet because dirt planet. Um, and then um, he wants to make a spaceship and he finds these droids and the droids are all like, oh, hey, we want to go find the other guy. So they go find the other guy who's who's this guy, the long leggy man from before. The long leggy man is there and he's all like, ah, you're a Skywalker. And he's all like, shit, I guess I am. I didn't change my name or anything because like, I'm going to be honest, if you're going to put somebody in witness protection program, you should probably change your last name. But I don't know. I'm not the fucking writer of I'm not George Lucas. Uh, what do I know about writing a story? Anyway, um, he's like, let's go, Skywalker. They go, they're going to go on a space adventure and he's going to become a little Jedi because I don't... Because because his sister here is all like, oh, I'm a princess and I got kidnapped and you should probably go save me. So they go on an adventure to go save the princess. So meanwhile, while well, they're fucking on this adventure to go save this princess, they meet this other douchebag and he's all like, hey, I'm a pilot. I can help you for money because I'm a douchebag pirate and he's got a stupid vest. Um... So they all team up together and then they go and they save the little, they save the princess girl. And she's like, ah, oh, thank you. And she doesn't know that's her brother. She, she kisses him. And then, um, this guy dies. Um, I think, I think Vader kills him. I'm like 60% sure that the guy who was like, I have the high, like Anakin, I have the high ground. The guy who doesn't like dirt, the emo kid. The emo kid kills him, I'm pretty sure. Um, if I recall correctly, the emo kid kills him. The, the evil emo kid robot. We're just going to call him... We're not going to call him Darth Vader. He's just emo kid robot. He kills him. I'm like 60% sure of this. And then he's all like, oh, I'm sad about this. And they're like, go talk to a Muppet. Boom. Next movie. The kid, space wizard. He's a little bit older now. He's talking to a fucking Muppet. The Muppet's like... Mm, yes, I'm a fucking Muppet is me. You are a Jedi. You gotta go save everybody. Meanwhile, I actually don't know what happens to everybody else uh, during this. Um, so he's training with a Muppet and I think the guy with the ugly vest is like doing illegal shit and, but he's also kind of like macking on the princess um, and then they're like, you should go fight, you should go fight Darth Vader. And he's like, I will go fight Darth Vader. So then he goes on to, um, oh no, I know what happens. Never mind. Uh, they go talk to a slug man and the slug man's like, you owe me a shit ton of money guy with a vest. And then they put the vest guy into a little block of ice. And she's like, oh, that sucks for him. And now he's in a block of row of, of rocks and shit. Uh, anyway, um, then this guy, the space wizard goes to another planet and, uh, he meets his dad, um, the robot guy. Um, and he's like, ah, I'm your dad because they didn't hide your name real well. I mean, you're Skywalker. I probably should have figured that out beforehand. Um, and this guy's like, 
Oh, they blow up the Death Star. I forgot about that. They explode his ship, and he's super pissed about it. And he's like, hey, son, you blew up... That was in this movie, I think. I think they blew up his... his... He had a circular ship, and it, it got exploded, and I think that was in this movie. Anyway, he, so he's super pissed about that, so he cuts off this guy's hand. Uh, and he's all like, ah, no, my fucking, my fucking hand. And he's like, I'm your dad. And he's like, that's kind of, that's kind of fucked up. Uh, and he's like, you should join me. And he's like, no. Um, and then he jumps off this cliff and he presumably dies. Boom. Next movie. Um, the guy with the, with the hand cut off, he's now got a robot hand. Do, 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 do. Meanwhile, the princess is all like to the slug person, hey, look at me, I'm super slutty. Look at my tits being out. And the slug guy's like, oh, yeah, titters. Um, and then the guy without a hand shows up and he's all like, hey, yo, you should give me the guy in the vest that you put in a block of ice. And the slug guy's like, no. And titty girl is like, I'm going to kill him. So she kills him. Uh, <laughs> and then, and then, um... This guy falls into a pit with teeth in it. Like it's a big pit and it's got teeth in it. And um, and he's like, I have killed your teeth, monster. Give me the man. And he's already choked and dead. So it doesn't fucking matter if he's choked and dead. Um, so that, 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 that all gets resolved. And then... Um, that part's resolved. Um, and then I think he has to do something. Uh, oh, wait, no, I remember. Then there's a second Death Star. As if the first circular base didn't blow up hard, hard enough. There's now a second Death Star. And he's like, oh, shit, I gotta blow that up. So he goes and he blows that up and he saves everything. And they're like, good, I'm glad that happened. And then they all go to a forest and then there's a bunch of little, like, little bears and stuff. And they go to the forest and we're like, we got to protect these little forest bears. And there's these big giant robots with legs that look like dogs. Like, like they, they look like this. And they're like, yeah, we're going to fuck up the little bear planet. And the little bears, like, make these Home Alone style traps to defeat the, to defeat the fucking, the big giant robots. And then they, and then he, and they defeat them. They trip them up and they're like, ha ha ha, the little bear people are like, ha ha, get fucked. Get fucked, you old bitch. And apparently that means that we've somehow defeated the Empire. So then the guy who got his hand cut off, um is enjoying the festivities. The bear people throw a little party and the princess like dances around and is like, yeah, we fucking did it. And she's got like a little bear who's all like, yeah, I fucking, yeah, this is fucking great. And the guy who got his arm cut off is all like, oh man, this was a really Jojo bizarre adventure. And then the ghost of his dad uh, shows up and is all like, you did good to defeat me. And then the other guys show up and he's like, I'd never met these men before in my life. But a whole bunch of ghosts show up and are like, you should run away from your problems. Boom. Next movie. Sometime in the future. That old guy back here, this guy, this little shitty guy had a baby. And she's a girl. And she's all like, I got powers or something. I've got midichlorians. And she lives in trash. And I didn't really pay attention too much to this movie, but she runs around in the trash heap until she finds um, a lightsaber. Meanwhile, there's a stormtrooper guy, and he's like, oh, man, I really don't like killing people. And this other guy's like, well, maybe you shouldn't kill people all the time. And he's like, man, shit, that would be good. And then this girl with the lightsaber shows up and is like, we'll have to take the trash and she gets this ship and then there's this really hairy guy who was in the first part that i wasn't explaining there's this really hairy guy and he's like Ooh. and she goes on the ship with him and then they go and they go to this other desolate planet and they find that first fucking guy and he's like hey i'm i'm a jedi and i live here just in the Jedi way, I avoid all my problems. And she's like, will you teach me to be a Jedi? And he's like, yeah, I guess. And then I didn't see the other two movies, but I do know definitely that this trash child is the daughter of this guy that convinced Anakin to be evil because um, uh, Matt told me. Uh, 
But yeah, that's the story of Star Wars as told by Wazzy.